Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome to the first Soon of Vague tutorial of today. In this video guys, I'm going to show you guys how to make like a like a, like a a lower third. And a lower third guys is actually something like this. I'll show you guys right here like what a lower third is. It's basically like a nice um, like animation of like some shapes and then you can put some text on it to introduce something. As you guys probably may know, um, in the series Evolving Into A Better YouTuber, I have always some orange black thing popping up in the corner like saying what episode it is and what's going to be discussed in the video. I'm going to show you guys not how to make one because that's something for After Effects, but I'm going to show you guys how to get one, how to download one, how to use one completely for free. So I would say let's get started. Alright guys, so we're in Sony Vegas right now as always and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to YouTube and I'm going to find a nice lower third that we can use. So what we're going to do now is we're going to start off by going to YouTube right now. Alright guys, so we are on YouTube right now and what you want to type in, you just want, you want to type in a lower third. Let's just type in lower third, let's see what we see. Okay, so as you can see, we have a lot of lower thirds, but what you want to do is you want to pick a lower third that has like a green or a black background so you can actually cut out, you know, the background. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on this playlist, 122 videos, and let's see what some awesome um, lower thirds are. Let's just switch back and forth between all the lower thirds and let's pick a nice one. So let's see the first one. As you guys can see, it's like with the circles and it looks pretty nice, guys. I mean, it looks it looks very good. There are so many out there. As you can see, like kind of news, like lower thirds. Um, but there's so many out there, so you can have like a news-ish kind of thing, as you can see. So we're going to move on to the next video and let's see what kind of lower thirds we have right here. As always, you just try to make sure you have a green or a black background like that, so you can cut out the background, it's that simple. Um, so let's, let's move on to a next one, let's see what we have. Okay, we have like a nice Twitter uh, lower third, that looks nice. Let's move on to a next video. Two hours later. So this one looks very nice, guys. As you can see, like it's popping up and then, you know, you know, the red bar. We're going to use this one. So what you want to do is you want to copy the link and you want to download this piece, this file to your computer, the actual file. You want to download this to your PC and just use it in Sony Vegas. So what we're going to do is we're going to use free make audio converter. It's a free program. I've been using it for years and you can actually convert it to any freaking format you can think of. So let me open up free make video converter and and as you, guys, as you guys can see right now, you can see all different formats like AVI, WMV, Apple, DVD, MPEG, MP4, MP3. So we're just going to paste in the link of the lower third and we're just going to pick MP4. Just choose where you want to save it. I'm just, I'm just going to pick the Sony Vegas one, save, and then click on convert. And now we have just to wait until this lower third has been, um, is finished downloading. So I think it's going to take a few more seconds and basically then we're going to go ahead and off from there. So it's like 60-70%. 80%, 90%, and boom, it's done. As you can see, conversion, Voltoid, that's, that's you know, complete in Dutch. Click on OK. We're gonna, I'm just going to show in folder, and we're going to drag this guy into Sony Vegas, and then we're going to put this guy on our timeline. Boom. So as you guys can see, we have a nice lower third, but Alex, why is that the green background? I'm going to come back to that in just a minute. So basically what we're going to do now is we're going to add in some other footage so we can actually see the lower third. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag in the intro of this video, put it underneath it. So let's, let me let me drag in that video real quick, the, little, the intro that I used. Okay, so as you can see, this is just me talking uh, about like the intro and everything. So what we're going to do is we're going to just put this guy over it. And as you can see, we have we don't see anything of the track. And you don't want to m m mess with the opacity, guys. That's not how it works. So what we're going to do is you want to always put your um, your order original video track uh, under your lower third track. So what we're going to do over is we're going to go over to the video effects and we're going to go, go to the C and you want to click, you want to pick chroma key. You just want to drag that on top of your green lower third. Boom. As you can see, we have, okay, so, okay, so this is the chroma key. And what you want to do is you want to pick the exact same color as this green, and then it's going to cut out the green and you will only see, you know, the red bar. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on the color, then this box pops up. You want to click on this really small icon boom then you can just choose a color in the screen you just want to click on the green one all right guys so i want to apologize because as you can see my face cam is a little bit in the way of the preview screen so you cannot see it properly well i forgot to change scene in obs so my bad as you can see 
boom there we have the lower third by itself it's that simple guys so let me add a little bit of brightness and contrast to my original clip so it looks a little bit better let me add in a preset there we go boom okay so let me show you guys what i got so as you can see when i play back the video the red is just appearing and you will you don't see any of the green because we took that out with the chroma key so that's the simple list guys and now you can just go ahead and add your text and we're just going to go to titles and text media generators and just you know put some text on top of it so i'm just going to create a new video track for the text and let's say we just, I'm going to type in, um, what can I type in? Let's say Sony Vegas Pro 13. Then we're going to make it a little bit smaller so that it fits in the in the bar. Then what we're going to do is make it a little bit smaller. And then you can just choose a different font if you want to spice it up a little bit more. So we have a different font, so we got to replace it a little bit. And basically, this is how you make a lower third, guys. It's that simple. You just want to put in your text. And there we go. Right here, we have a new lower third. So what you can do is make this lower third, you know, make the text fade in. So it looks pretty nice, as you can see. So that's how awesome it looks, guys. Just by fading in the text a little bit, this is what we created so far. Have you guys seen that? Let me, let me play it back for, uh, for you guys again. So that's the symbol is guys, that's how you make a lower third, you can do this with anything that has a green background, just you go to the video effects, just pick the chroma key, and then just choose the green color, so you will delete the green color out of the screen, that's the symbol is guys, that's how you add an awesome lower third, as you can see it just goes and then it fades in, you can put in your own text right there, so that's the symbol is guys, that's how you make a lower third or add a lower third, it's really simple I know, and I've showed you guys everything, there's nothing more to show you guys, that's it for this video, so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. So that's what you this guys that's how you make a lower third so hope you guys enjoyed if you don't make sure to smash the like button down below and make sure also to smash the subscribe button down below for more videos i hope you guys enjoyed this video now you can go ahead and enjoy your lower third and you create so many the options are endless guys there's so many out there and you can you all use them just by using this technique so thank you so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video i cannot imagine a better audience than you guys almost 28 and a half thousand subscribers as i pop up the sub counter right now it says 28,272. are you guys kidding it's freaking amazing guys thank you so much for that and hope to see you guys in two hours for the last episode of stone vague tutorials of today so i will see you guys in two hours